No, no, you don't. Hear me. Don't you dare. Please, don't do this to me. Shani? Geralt? What are you doing here? I'm trying to save his life. Help me! Shani, calm down. He's dead. I'm sure something can be done. Let it go. Damn it! All for nothing. You did all you could. Thanks, Geralt. It's, uh... Good to see you. You too. Lost track of you after I left Vizima. Where'd you go? What have you been doing? Um, long story short, I've been treating the sick and wounded as always, mainly at my clinic in Oxenford. But in Redania, I'm called on to help the army at times as well. I'll want to hear the long story long too. Sure. But uh, once we're out of these sewers... Redanian army force you to come here too? Were you just down here for a pleasant stroll? Got our orders this morning. I came down here with a whole unit, but something attacked us. The soldier. He's someone important to you? His name was Nalls. Supposed to go on leave next week. Now he won't. Nor will the rest of his unit. How many were they? A whole squad. Six brave boys. All dead. What attacked you? Get a good look at it? No. I started running as soon as it appeared. It was huge. Spat venom and made these slurping sounds. That's all I know. Hmm. Doesn't sound like a major necrophage or a pack of drowners. No. This was one thing. Big, but one. Somebody threw a torch at it. Monster couldn't have cared less. All right. Not afraid of fire. Good to know. Why'd they send you down here? Only if it's not confidential, of course. I need a venom sample. From the beast that prowls these sewers. It doesn't just kill those who come down here, you know. The water in so many wells is contaminated. Folk are getting ill. Redanian soldiers among them. Plan to kill the beast. Bring you a sample of its venom after I do. Nice of you to offer. But I'd rather go with you. Collect the sample myself. Creature's dangerous. You saw what it can do. I'm a big girl, Geralt. I can take care of myself. And you know I'll get my way, so don't try and talk me out of anything. <sighs> Fine. Your choice. So show me where the monster attacked you. This way. Grating's badly bent. Something large struck it, with a lot of momentum. I shut it as I fled. The monster must have slammed into it. Glad it held up. So now we need to find a way around it. Is it worth searching outside? Actually, just hoping the monster's blow weakened one of the walls. Careful, monster might still be here. Soldiers from your escort? Yes. That's them. Vern, Miklas. Oh, poor boys. Beast doesn't play around, apparently. They saved my life. Know them well? Him, I met this morning. But Vern and I served together at the Battle of Dorian. Miklas only enlisted this Yule. Sorry. Once you kill this beast, we'll have to send someone down here to collect their bodies. Give them a proper burial. What exactly happened? We came in here and Miklas started looking for tracks. Then drowners attacked. The men made quick work of them. 
but Franz was injured. His leg. He and I stayed behind. I tried to bandage him up while Nalls stood watch. Then that beast appeared. Nalls pushed me towards the exit and ran at the monster. I turned around and saw him lying there, covered in a sticky substance. I ran back to get him, then dragged him to where you found us. Where was the monster? Well, Miklas and Vern had driven it away from us, and paid dearly for it. Managed to get a look at what attacked you? Everything happened so fast. I didn't get a good look, no. Only saw it from behind. I know it was large and slimy. Gotta look around. Man you patched up, is he here? Franz? I don't see him. Think the monster might have dragged him off? Could have. Hmm. Beast probably crawled in or out through here. It's deep. The lower level of the sewers has been closed off for years. But Vern, the commander, had a skeleton key. See if I can't find it. Get going. Legend going around about this monster being a prince turned into a toad, a curse or something. I've heard. A lot of women have fallen for it. I find out who started that rumor, I'll strangle them. So, don't believe it? <laughs> I studied medicine, not literature. I stopped believing in fairy tales long ago. Another unfortunate romantic came to lift a prince's curse, found a hideous death instead. for later. Shawnee, watch out! Move!
hideous creatures. You all right? Mm, fine. Look, it's bronze. What's left of him, you mean? What kind of beast would do that? Hmm. What? Franz had a leg wound, right? Mm-hmm. Just above the knee. Managed to apply anything to it? Yes. Some spirit, but that was it. Why do you ask? Look, half of Franz's leg is gone. Monster must have chewed it off. Other bodies were untouched, except for the wounds they sustained in battle. Are you suggesting... the beast likes alcohol? Mm-hmm. Mixed with blood. Does that mean anything? Well, means our monster doesn't attack them. Seems they get along with whatever's prowling the sewers. Some kind of symbiosis. Doubt we'll learn anything else here. We need to find the lair. Right behind you. Shawnee, watch out! Move! Slime everywhere, and that stench. This has to be the lair. Fresh and moist. Beast was just here. I'll collect my sample. Huh. All the tunnels and corridors converge here. What now? Need to lure the beast. How? We don't even know what kind of monster it is. But we do know it likes a blend of blood and liquor. Just so happens I've got some alcohol on me. Well, I hope you don't plan to cut yourself or... Relax. Plenty of bodies. I'll use one of them. Sample you collected enough? Hope so. But I'd still like to get some pure venom. Once you've killed the monster. To distill an antidote? No use for it once the beast's dead. Not true. I have a few poison patients on hand. Besides, I can study the venom, test it, Maybe discover some interesting properties. I'll get to work. Hmm. I doubt I'd be much help in the fight, but you might need me afterwards. I'll look for a hiding place. You'd be better off waiting for me up top, or back home. But... No buts. Wait in the passage for now if you have to, though I'd rather you didn't. But when the monster shows, you run for the surface. Ugh, fine. Shani, look at me. Promise you'll stay out of it. I promise. Good. Now go hide. Be careful, Geralt.
Galavec Khan. Gatherash Isle Wood. Finally come to, and he can speak human. Turns out, started thinking I'm not conversing common the whole way, except maybe with my reflection in the piss bucket. Where, where am I? On the albatross, or the fuck bath oil? It's their strange tongue, has it? En route to a fear. Don't remember signing on as a sailor. <laughs> oh, you didn't, mate. They dragged you aboard. Seems you killed their prince. Damn it. Don't remember a thing. Just some sewers, giant toad, and some boots. If that toad was their prince, guess I'm lucky to be alive. Depends how you look at it. Happen to know a bit of a theory. Heard them saying they come here on a mission, dispatched by their king, to find their prince. Lift his curse. Wagered their honor. That of their families five generations back, that they'd bring him home safe and sound. And I killed him. Great. So, must think they can save their honor by bringing the prince's murderer back to face the king's justice. And who might you be? Felipe Calagrand, at your service. Petty thief, professional fence, and your guide about Oxenford. What a bit of time. Why are you here? You kill a prince too? Well, to their thinking, I had a hand in this one's death. See, I was their guide. Led them down into the sewers. But not until after you'd cut their prince's gut open. Sorry about that. Not your fault, mate. When all said and done, could have sat on my ass in the alchemy playing Gwent. Didn't have to brag about knowing Oxenford better than my own breeches. We been at sea long? To know Riley. Not that long. Though, on the other hand. <laughs> but what's it matter, any road? Matters a lot. If they're hauling me off to hang me, I'm not in a hurry to arrive. Me? I'm glad to be silent to a fear. I hear they got wild horses there. White, with black stripes. Always wanted to see one of them. Sure, they're not. Black horses with white stripes. Nay, black horses with white stripes they got in Zangwebar. That I'm sure of. Listen, there was a young woman, a medic, red hair. They capture her too? Don't recall seeing anyone of the sort. You were alone. Good. Means she managed to flee. Hopefully made it home. Tried to break out yet? Ah, used every ounce of charm I got. Nothing doing. Might be Maya Fury's, Rusty. Maya Fury's non-existent. Well, we'll be at sea at least a month. Could teach you something that time. Elkal! Orial. What's that mean? Told us to shut up. There's been a misunderstanding. Can I talk to your captain? Alakal Sorkan! Galabat Kar U Albata again! Quiet, dog. You killed our prince, and you'll pay for that. Gilea Valar! Karvarethaner! You'd be dead already. Revhag ne Arami! Vengeance is not ours to be. Dorgate ye Alami! We swore on our oath. How do I say? Take me to your captain. Valf Alache ul Egulaf. What? Elkal! Valf. Valf Alage ul Egilef. Elkal. Inkal avr ikel ugeherevn ul vita. Inch avr kolayath. What just happened? What did he say? He said to sit quiet, and that you'll hang in two weeks. And then, he added something like, We'll see who's in the mood for jokes then. Why? What did I say? Uh, along the lines of, I want your nose bouncy bouncy. Utter nonsense. Great. 
Give it a rest. No point talking to that lot. All you get's angry gurgles. And they puff up, you notice? While them fish. What's it they're called? There anyone here who speaks common? Ah, there's this mercenary with them. Looks Adernian to me. He's the one recruited me to show him through the sewers. Oh, and the mage, what leads them, knows a bit. Heard him talking. But I doubt either will talk to you. Uh, that was you. Catch some shut eye. Not go on flapping my tongue. Got a long voyage ahead. Sleep's not what I need. Someone I can actually communicate with. That's what I want. Greetings, Geralt. Remember me? I remember. We met in White Orchard. You're... Gaunter Odin. Known also as Master Mirror. I helped you find your Yennefer. We meet again. And it seems you need my help again. Heard a noose awaits you. That is, if this slot doesn't kill you first. Haven't tried it yet. It doesn't look promising. Not unlike your situation. I could try to extract you from here, you know. Because you do wish to disembark, do you not? Yeah, sure. But what on earth could you? Oh, more than you'd ever expect. I shall help you, Geralt. But before I do, I must know you'll return the favor. Right. Can't possibly get something for nothing. Indeed. When all's said and done, I am a merchant. So, do you want my help? Yes. It's a deal. Once it's all over, we shall meet at midnight at the crossroads, beneath the willows near the village of Yantra. Ah, and I must give you something to remember me by. What's that? A mark to show we're associates. Who are you gabbing with? With... no one. Oh, never like boats. Not one bit. They heave like devils. Make me stomach churn. Oh, it'd be prime to sleep through the whole thing. Didn't bargain for no storm. I fear that means a tidy jump in my feet. To a fear get us safe. The king's reward will be generous. What about the prisoner? Before the king we must bring him. On doing so, my honor relies. Can we just bring your king the bastard's head? Like we're doing with the other? The other drought. We could do nothing. We deliver lie, this one. Apart from all else. The hell the king is sure to condemn him to. I wish to see him. What kind of hell? Ari, flaying, and water. This is for regicide and pains.
Stefan, ich also. That's it, Roach. I knew you'd come. You a soothsayer? It matters little who I am. 
Your escape, I made it possible. Previously, Yennefer, you found her thanks to me, so you feel you owe me. Memento you gave me. Pretty effective reminder. That is its purpose. Incidentally, I find it quite funny how even the most rotten scoundrels have this inner compunction to repay debts of gratitude. Humans, elves, dwarves, all races. You really must explain that to me one day. As for the here and now, tell me, how'd you manage with your theories? Thanks for your help, really. But you could have chosen more conventional means, given me the key to myself, for instance. Oh my, far too simple. I dislike simple solutions. Do you like them? Doubt we're here to talk about my preferences. True. I'd much rather tell you about an individual of interest to us both. It's about a man, worse than most. A vulgar, despicable man with a heart of stone. A man who refuses to pay his debts. Really think this'll interest me? Any reason why? He's wronged you as well. His name is Olgierd von Everett. How do you know we'd met, and that I'm not exactly thrilled with him now? Please, Geralt. I knew the Ophiri had captured you. Was I not to know how this had come to pass? Olgierd von Everick did willfully and maliciously conspire to cause you to kill a man who might have been cured. Had I not intervened, you would have lost your head for this. Do you know why he did it? Because he's a degenerate monster in human flesh who feeds on the pain and suffering of others. Well, you clearly don't like him. What did he do to you? He and I made a pact. A pact under which I called on my many talents and associates to give him what he desired. And now the time's come to pay. Yet, he shirks his obligation. Need me to collect a debt? I'm not some hired muscle. Muscle is not what this requires. It needs a soul intelligent and clever. An individual who fears no dare. Someone like you. Pure flattery, that. Of course it is. After all, I am a traveling merchant. But make no mistake. I have many interesting wares on offer. Wares like? Surfeit. Abundance for the body and soul. You will lack neither food nor drink. As a witcher, you might desire weapons supreme. I can offer you those you dreamt of. Your body, agile as never before. Your mind, faster than lightning. Romantic prowess to charm all womankind. But above all, I offer a great and true adventure. An experience like no other, the fate only the chosen few. Sure sounds generous. And all that for my help with one small matter. Won't want anything else from me? Just one. Honesty. What about you? Call yourself a man of many talents? Can't you take care of this? Therein lies the catch. Our pact states that before I can collect my due, I must yet fulfill three wishes for Von Everick. But I cannot fulfill them myself directly, making use instead of a, mm, how shall I put it, a proxy. Mm-hmm. So what you need's a sucker. What I need is an ally. And something tells me I shall find none better than you. What do you expect me to do? To start with, join me in paying Von Everick a visit. Then, well, then we shall improvise. I believe, however, that all will end well. And, once it does, we three shall meet and thank one another for the voyage we shared. Right. Specifics now. Thought Olgierd had three wishes, requests, whatever. Uh, he does. He may ask three things of us. Yet, we won't know what they are until we see him. Fine. 
I'll go see Algird with you, but no promises. That is all I ask. Now remove the damn mark. Naturally. Just as soon as you complete your task. Go. You will not regret it. Another debt to collect? Perhaps. It's clearing up.